join the HR Operations Council are typically leading HR operations globally in their business. Um, our member companies are large global organisations and we have a tremendous diversity in the businesses that join the Council and that adds to the richness of the conversation. Topics that the Council discusses evolve over time and it's been very interesting to see the maturity of the HR Operations Council evolve over time. The agenda is member driven, uh, so that's how it evolves organically. Right now, topics of interest are what is the portfolio of the future, particularly as HR Operations has been moving up the value chain. Um, so, so how do they do that in, 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 in an efficient and, 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 and service driven way? The operating model going forward is also a, a topic for discussion in terms of where does operations fit in the context of overall HR. A lot of this has been driven by the digitization automation agendas, but equally by user experience expectations and how do you meet those. And in operations there's a real healthy tension and challenge in terms of how do you deliver a fantastic experience in a productive and efficient way. Typically people join this council when they want to meet um, fellow leaders, practitioners who are responsible for HR operations, who have a lot of experience, have quite a lot of experience in this field already. Um, they're looking to meet in, in a safe environment. We say it's not a show and tell. Of course there is sharing, but it's really the heart of it is around problem solving gaining insights on how you address challenges today and then co-developing you know what does the future look like with peers that that's really fascinating sometimes councils bring um, experts in from outside for particular topics sometimes they like to you know really just share the richness of the experience in the room